John Gill's Exposition of the Bible Text And the holy garments of Aaron shall be his sons after him, to be anointed therein, and to be consecrated in them. Exodus 29:29. Commentary And the holy garments of Aaron shall be his sons after him. That son that succeeded him in the priesthood, for the priesthood continued in Aaron's family by succession, the eldest son being high priest, until the disposal of this office fell into the hands of heathen princes, and then it was obtained by interest or money. Now, though the coat and breeches might be wore out by Aaron before he died, yet the robe of the ephod, and the ephod, and its girdle, and the breastplate, might continue, and go from father to son, and especially the latter, even to succeeding ages, see Numbers 20 26, 28. To be anointed therein, and consecrated in them, this is to be understood only of the high priesthood, and of anointing and consecrating to that, for none but high priests were anointed, and their sons who succeeded them in that office, and who were anointed, and consecrated in like manner as Aaron was, by washing, clothing, anointing, and sacrificing.